Hello everybody. This is Val with This Is How You Do It. And I made this um, black bean noodle from scratch. And I made a video showing it. And I'm going to upload that video. I thought about putting it in with this one. But I'm thinking it may be too, um, too long for that. Now, I'm going to mix this together as best I could in this small container here. Let's see what we got here. I made this with rice noodles, 100% rice noodles. Mm. And vegetables. I used a black bean paste. Mm. I think I should make some more sauce next time or stir it up before I start but this is good it goes down easy too. It's real smooth. I see why they use a bowl. And come out the plate.
I had brought a napkin. At least I thought I did. Mm. Must have left it on in the kitchen, on the sink, by the sink, when I got my water. I'll lift it up, then it won't touch the face. Mm. I used the rice noodle because that's just something I wanted to try. I guess you can use any kind of new you want them. Now, I also put this over rice. Believe it or not, this is just one pack of noodles. One tablespoon of paste. It's starting to let the slide off. That's why I moved it over.
I didn't put any meat in it. With some dishes calls for um, small strips of pork. But I didn't do that. I fried my vegetables with vegetable oil. I could have used small pieces of beef, but I just chose not to go the meat route. And I just knocked all the stuff over here. Better and better. Carrot. Onions. Sweet peas. Beans. I know the traditional day, the traditional vegetable, if vegetable. Is onion, a potato. If you like zucchini, cabbage, to come up a garnish. But this is bad, and this is how she do it. She'll make her nasty. But all of those ingredients can be found anywhere. You don't use the whole cabbage, just a piece, a little bit of it. According to the dish that you're making. For how many people? Mm. And one big potato. Probably medium sized onion. Regular sized zucchini. I said cucumbers just for looks. You know, sprinkle it on there, make it look pretty. Julienne chop. Put some seeds on it if you want them. Sesame seed, whatever. I wanted to put it in this plate because it shows how much it is. It's a lot <laughs> when it's in this plate, but it's trying to fall out of the plate. Excuse me.
I'm glad I just made one. I don't want to stop the video because I stopped my stride and then let uh, me mm, stop. I think this thing is leaning that way. That's why I waist over there. It's just a towel. Do it in the wash machine time I get off here. I guess you can call this a vegan meal. All vegetables, rice noodles, 100%. Um, all natural. And vegetables. When I was at the store, I was looking for some rice cakes, but I couldn't find any. I saw that yellow 
relish. A little long one, real deep, deep, dark yellow that they cut up in your food. But I heard that that causes cancer. I'm not sure. But they say it's written on the packages that it causes cancer. I looked at it. But people eat it anyway. You know how you always think that'll happen to somebody else? It won't happen to me. And then you feel like your life just like a movie. If you haven't subscribed, this would be a good time to do so. And I thank you. I think I like to thank my subscribers, but thank but thank y'all for keep coming back watching you girl. And I thank y'all that just stopped by just to see what in the deal I was doing. <laughs> thank you. Hey, black noodles. Mm -hmm. Black bean, honey. Bean. Try to help scoop some of this stuff up. Mm -hmm. I should keep trying to slide at the plate. Y'all ever try to? Do you like it? When it comes to recipes, I believe you can tweak a recipe. To suit your taste. Now I think this probably need a little more salt in it to me, but I'm off the salt. Not off it. Cut back on it. I still eat potato chips and good old stuff like that, y'all. Mm -hmm. And once in a while, I try to not to be excessive with it.
Now, this didn't have no vegetables with it. I can see it going down real easy. Excuse me, real quick. Mm. I don't know if this these noodles are called P H O Park or something like that. But I was looking for them noodles too. It was a lot of Japanese or Korean writing on it, so Chinese or Korean. So I don't know if the if that was it or not. But you'll see the video. And it's easy to make, y'all. Real easy. All you need is the right ingredients. And just come together like a hand and glue. You can also use thick noodles with this, like linguine and different stuff like that. You don't have to get these rice noodles. I, I got some um, lo mein noodles while I was out also. 